Hey guys, what is up? I am Devil Driven. It's Monday. It's a little bit late on the video for Ladder Leverage, but it's Ladder Leverage Day, and we got Wasubi with us. How are we doing today, sir? Hey man, uh, all good. Glad to be back for some monsters action. Yeah, we had uh, we had some fun with the uh, Kelly deck. Um, we actually recorded this last week, but nothing's changed. So, um, still a really really good deck. Honestly, like I was, I I recorded an intro for this before I knew we were going to be able to get one done. Um, but I feel like if you're gonna go for something like a big build and you're a newer player, man, I would honestly go for this, man. It's just a, it's if you can get the Siri behind the defender. It's just so good, man. I mean, yeah. It's it's just card advantage in Gwent is always going to be king, man. Way too strong, yeah. Especially when you have something like the Ozreal finisher for a short round. Right. You value the the last say or double last say a lot, yeah. And it's an it's it's kind of like. I, I mean, it's kind of a no unit deck. I mean, you got a lot of these specials, you know. Mm -hmm. And um, yeah. I'm just I'm just a huge fan. I I used to not like it, and then I played with Goreflow with it, and I was like, you know what, this yeah, it's it's a pretty good deck. And then me and you were jamming it, and I'm like, all right, man, I'm sold on it. it it's it's quite good, yeah. Like you've got these big important engines. Well, not so not so much as big, but like they do a lot of work, right? Mm -hmm. Nithril, Beast, and the Phantom. Yeah. To like help you out, and yeah, I mean, you're staying low. Uh, with the amount of units inside, on your side of the board for kill toolies, obviously. So there's like a lot of specials. But yeah, I mean, that's that's usually the plan. Yeah. The Nithral is... I, I love this edition. I love un, like engines that do damage. And this thing, you're, right. you're yeah, almost yeah. always going to have a beefy boy on the board, man. So this mm. thing's doing two a turn. It's like... He's just... Yeah, and like he, he goes to aid with the leader charge or you just have him behind the defender and like... It's, it's really strong. Yeah. You combine it with the Dimitrium bombs or natural selections and you can kill six, uh, five and six strand engines. It's really strong. Yeah. 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 And, and you almost always have an answer for like Gezerus and stuff like that with Immerit's Wrath and Heat Wave and stuff. Yeah. Uh, plus, Earth if you're well. an actual talented friend and have a Nero, you have the option for either. Yeah. But... <laughs> That's that's the thing with this deck. Like it, it kind of can fall victim to draws because yeah, you really need the Oniromancy, Cave Troll, or Siri. That's like your ideal round one. You also want to get the Eagern down early for the Ozreal. Um But yeah, the, that's the nice thing about Maxi, right? Yeah, it like, gives you a second chance to shuffle and put put the garbage on the bottom. Exactly. If you don't you need the squirrel, drawing, you know you can it, dump it. Yeah, usually, usually you dump like a, like a red haze if it's bad or like a random special. But yeah, like it's it's so nice in a neuromancy deck, right? If 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 you see that you're not gonna draw your gold and that your neuromancy is like somewhere at the bottom, then it's just an easy shuffle. Yeah, um, yeah, really fun deck. I mean, Wasubi had a couple games. Uh, one, it's gonna show you what not to do against uh, <laughs> a Kelly. Yeah. Um, it, it's not. It's not big brain as you think it is, but um... yeah, I mean, like that—that's the thing with like some players. They just tend to give up when they know that um, the matchup is either unfavored or they simply don't draw their answers, right? Because this deck will ask you like very specific questions, and like if you just can't answer those threats, then what can you do, right? Yeah, it's. Uh... Like I said, I, I really, I originally I didn't like the list, but I'm a huge fan of it. And if mm -hmm. if you're looking for something to to build and yeah. you're a newer player, I really think this deck is something you should shoot for because yeah, it doesn't seem like, like it's going guy. anywhere, and uh, like mm -hmm. there's no big outcry for like nerf Kelly or nerf Siri. Yeah, like, it's yeah, it, it's kind of harder to play. There's like a lot of decisions to be made, but like once you get the basics down, you will definitely climb in no time. Yeah, a um, couple games today. Uh, anything coming from the website, Wasubi? Um, Don't think so no. for now. I mean, we're just updating the meta report on the day, and yeah, that's that's pretty much it. Yeah, a couple couple Kelly, different decks I mean, will Kelly be in there. 
The Kelly is tier one in there, yeah. I, I I would imagine some people were surprised by that, but if you think about it, like you just have so many good matchups in the meta right now. Like yeah. Witchers, Skellige Warriors, like they're all they can't really deal with this deck, right? Mm -mm. And then as, as far as Skrattel is concerned, I guess uh it's really good against Nature's Gift because that's a devotion deck, but like the Dead Eye is a bit of an issue. Right. They they run like heat wave, purify, movement. And I mean Nilfgaard, um yeah, Nilf Nilf Nilfgaard can go either way, honestly. Yeah, if, if they have like the purify, if they have like the, the cup bear and stuff, it's probably gonna yeah. get ugly for you, but I mean, but but like you still, if if it's a ball deck, you have the heat wave. I mean, there's a lot of stuff you can do. Yeah. Uh, yeah. But again, like they need to draw all their cards as well, right? Like they need the cup bear, they need the invo. If they don't draw either of those, it's yeah, really unfortunate for them. Yeah, it's gonna get ugly. Um, yeah. One last thing. Uh, good luck to uh, brother Jams in the open. Um, in case uh, you know we don't get a like a ladder leverage or something, or I just flat out forget man uh good luck man i hope you i hope you take the whole damn thing <laughs> yeah, brother john making it in you know, yeah brother nice. james so good luck to him uh couple games like always uh wasubi thanks for recording with me brother i appreciate you and uh thank you guys so much man for just uh watching the videos it seems like i get more views on Nilfgaard than anything i love Nilfgaard, but we gotta <laughs> we gotta mix it up a little bit man there's only like lockdown and i'm a huge like negative person towards cloggers so i you you really won't see any cloggers coming from me people have their Nilfgaard, yeah yeah but um a couple games we'll see you guys at the end it's Kelly, I am out. Double cross. You Mr. Now. Lockdown. I mean, it's could. Uh, I think it's just a ball deck, right? Usually. But. We drop the squirrel. Mm -hmm. Sure. Not sure how much value Red Haze will find, but. Probably drop it, right? It's just not a good card. Pact is good. Yeah, could see. Just keeping this hand, honestly. Pretty good hands. So what do we go with? Mm. Mithril. Well, the thing is, if you... If you Crystal Skull, the uh, Siri, it plays into the Leo. Which means we probably want to just leader charge it. I think you just open with Syria. Syria and a leader charge. What could possibly go wrong? <laughs> and, right? And Vincent. Yeah, exactly. That's that's the only. Well, the Leo gets it no matter what because it's a Witcher, right? Right, 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 right. But, like, uh, you save a point, essentially. You can use the Crystal Skull on something else, right? Yeah. So we just ah. bomb that, huh? Mm -hmm. it, do we bomb that, or do we selection it? I guess selection, right? Could be awkward if you ever spawn drones on your side of the board, I guess. I mean, there's no way. Uh, he cannot deal with this, right? He's just giving us false hope, as they usually do, these Nilfgaard players. <laughs> right. That's their, like, favorite thing to do, just... Wait, what? Uh, okay. Well then, I guess... Wait, no, what? Why? I could have played the Maxi. Oh, to see it. Yeah, like... I'll uh, reshuffle. I guess it's fine, it's fine. There's the Nero, there's the... Okay, we don't want double packed, right? Don't think so. Just kick one. Yeah, this red haze just keeps coming back. Like, you're not wanted. Get out. Do we drop <laughs> the maxi or we keep it? Yeah, the maxi is good, yeah. Just to see what you're getting for round three. We got the defender. I think red haze is really bad. Yeah, that's good. This um... Is 
Maybe now you can ditch the Maxi because you managed to draw all of your golds anyway. Alright, so what goals did we actually miss here? We only miss Cave Troll, Phantom, and Osril. And then there's still Wrath, yeah. So the question is, do we actually want to go for the Cave Troll? Hmm. Do we just play the Yigurn off the bat? Or you could go Neithral as well. Just Neithral le Leader Charge. Because, yeah, the only way to deal with that is like invocation, right? Mr. Opponent is like, oh, my Paz was so cheeky, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Cyberpunk, friend. <laughs> yeah. I mean, like, the issue with going Yigurn is you just. Oh, he purifies. Oh, yeah, yeah. So, does he have invo for the defender? Because now we just slam the defender. We go in Nero. Yeah. Oh yeah. You know how it goes in this household. You have to draw the Ozreal, sir. Just be skilled. All right. Smack. Yeah, this is a it's a game, all right. <laughs> like I don't know what's going on actually. Oh uh, yeah yeah. Ah, heat there's wave. the ball. So we heat wave that. Heat. Yeah, easy heat. Because that's actually his way to deal with the... And also, like, he cannot heatwave us anymore, so that's good. Which one do I hit? Uh, probably the dame, yeah. Shouldn't matter too much, actually. And then if this he... This won't do much, actually. But... Well, I mean, he's... St well, yeah, because of the Joaquim's and stuff. But we definitely want to play Yigher next, I think. Just to reduce the odds of him actually leadering into it. Yeah, yeah, we played immediately, I think. Yigern and then maybe, like... Uh, do we actually want to kill stuff? We kill this, right? Do we? Like... We have the... We have an equal amount of units, right? I don't oh, think you actually want to kill yeah. stuff. Yeah, I think you just want to, like... Spread the damage evenly. And... No, there okay, it is. Now we can think about killing stuff, yeah. But These not really. We still don't really have to kill back. stuff. Okay, just go Kelly and the game is over, yeah. Um, what do we hit? One of the fours. Yeah. yeah. This game is so easy that Nithral and Kelly have sort of a anti synergy, right? <laughs> uh, yeah. What is that? See. So next we get the beast, and he has a bunch of garbage cards he has to play from. Yeah, pretty much. And if he grabs the beast from with leader, we can just bomb it. Ah, right? oh, that's unfortunate. Okay, so the Skelly is just gonna smurf so hard. He's gonna like not click the. Yeah, so smart. So just kill it. Kill what? The well, we could, we could just kill the Usurper, yeah, but I mean, like, his goal is to... 2, 4, 6, 7, so we have 7 units, he has, um, 5. So one of the 3's is gonna burn. One of, no, fine. the 2 burns. Oh, the 2 burns, okay, and then the 3 burns. Yeah, I mean, we can just play the Beast, we don't really care about Kelly burning our own units. Now we can just start. I guess you still don't kill stuff. Yeah, just keep dealing two per turn, right? Yeah. Usurper is under. Yeah, I mean, it's kind of cheeky, but. Next we get the Hound. Mm hmm. So, where does he go with this? Well, first of all, he's a worthless leader. <laughs> and then. Ah, uh, it's packed. Yeah, what what else? What else, sir? Ah, the fangs. I see, I see. Damage a unit by four and veil. <laughs> well, we could also just leader charge it, that's better. I think you packed though. Just, uh. Not the, not the cave troll, but something else. Like, uh, the Neithral, probably. Yeah, 
Just leave there the shit. Should be good. Do we leader charge it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, if he has another fang, he actually gets through and... I mean, I don't think it even matters anymore, but... We do have one more unit. Uh, no, no, we're equal now, right? Ah, okay. I mean with this. <laughs> no, we're not. <laughs> oh, you mean like we have one more unit to play? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, oh. well... How the tables... After. Do we actually have a soldier? He does. Okay. So he has two, four, five, eight units. We have two, four, six, seven units. So we don't want to play a unit here, right? No. Probably just uh, parasite or something. I don't know. Yeah. What if he's a Yurden friend? Ah, uh, whatever. We win the game anyway. <laughs> Fine. You could have Parasite offensively, right? Just hit the Usurper. It's fine too. Yeah. Can just smack it. Ah, uh, now the Fang burns and then every unit he plays burn. Oh, okay. He's like, I'll take it now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh no. Yeah, it's funny how Gwent works like that. Okay, well. So now I we guess. Yeah, Red Haze and Selection. Uh. Packed as well. I guess, I mean, keeping Osril's. Wow. Well, this that's is... a terrible hand. Wow. Okay. Well. So we play Maxi off the bat, huh? Mm -hmm. I suppose we do, man. I don't know what to say. So, how does this card work? I've actually never played it. So, Onira is all the way at the bottom, so I think we reshuffle anyways. Just put the Red Haze at the bottom. Basically, what you can do is if you're satisfied with the order, you can confirm choice and nothing happens. And then you know what you're drawing. But yeah, just click the red haze, I think. Yeah. This is one of the worst hands probably I've seen <laughs> lately. I mean, it can happen with Kelly, right? Like the deck has a lot of uh, janky cards, so to speak. So we parasite that. Yeah, we parasite that for sure. And then... Uh, yeah, I mean... Unfortunately, we didn't even draw our specials, really. Like, we don't have D-bombs or whatnot. Yeah, it's an ocean deck, sure. Just go beast, probably. TA, huh? Uh, do we go front draw? Well, he's gonna have a Witcher, right? I mean, they, the cards yeah, are just. There's a rush. Oh. Yeah, so. We I can play we the back. squirrel. Sure, but. Uh, I guess so. Yeah, let's go front, sure. Why not? Play it or no? You can. Could have done it last turn to be cheeky. Play around the old critters. <laughs> They never see them coming, that's how they get you. Well, and this is basically all of our cards. <laughs> Isn't that funny? It's like, yep, Maybe he uses true. a Nero. Oh, no, no, he can't. He's, he's a devotion. No, okay. It's a devotion deck, yeah. It's just like devotion, gorilla tactic. It's really good against Kelly, just because of the leader ability, right? Like, yeah. Moves your Nithral, moves your Kelly, and goodbye. Yeah. Unfortunately, we didn't find our Siri, which is really stupid, but... Cool. Wow. That's into, committal. Into the Witcher. That's really committal. Oh. This? Okay. Guess we just wrath it? Yeah, How do we deal with Gezerus? So, I mean, we have heat wave still, yeah. We just wrath it, I think, yeah. 
Like, so if we're we gaining, we're still gaining one a turn. Yeah, exactly. Like, if we manage to win the round with this garbage hand, then that's like really good for us. Oof. But I don't know about that really because what? No. Okay, uh, packed, I guess, on the maxi. Yeah. Interesting game, that's for sure. Our hand is... So dysfunctional. <laughs> yeah. To put it mildly. <laughs> like... We didn't even find the Yeghern, that's how sad this hand is. He's gonna play uh, Malena now. Mm. Nope. Yeah, I guess. Too late now. Yeah. Thing is, like... Whoa. Uh, it's. Wait, is he going for the roll boost guy or for the. Okay, he's going for the engine. Sure. Hit the beast. Nice. Uh, so, do we get select? out? I think you selection the engine. Yeah. I don't think you ever get out, actually. I think you would even go like two cards down just to win the rounds somehow. Pretty important to win the round, let's just say that. Problem is he can start playing all these engines right now and it's just like not very There's not too much we can do about that really, right? Rebuke. Okay. He's just keeping the maxi low power, making sure we don't get too many boosts. I mean could still be a pass for us, but yeah, we play the squirrel, I think, and then they rush it. And then... Yeah. Uh, rebuke, banish is good, in case he has forest protector. Yeah, exactly. I mean, if he's smart, he just kills the squirrel, right? With like a leader charge, pretty much. But I don't know, yeah, he's not very smart, as it appears. Maybe he <laughs> has another rebuke? Maybe that's why. But yeah, I tempered. Oh, temper. Uh, yeah, I think it's a rush for sure. Get another two on the beast, which is really good. Mm. What worries me is that we actually might have to heat wave here just to win the round. And then, yeah, I don't know what we do. Gezrus goes ham, huh? Yeah. How scary is Gezra actually, right? Like, that's the question. Oh, well, that's good. Gives us a better heat wave, kinda, sorta. You really should be hitting. Yeah, thank god. You're actually. Ah. Uh... I mean, do we just pass on that? I don't know. Probably. So if we heat wave this, he drops to. Um, he's at twenty four right now, so it's like uh, it, it's not even a comfortable re lead, honestly. Yeah, I think he pass. We got we got some things out of him, and also like these two cards in we hand. We play junk. <laughs> We just don't have an answer for Gezerus. We do have the heat wave still, right? Oh, that's true, yeah. But thing is... Yeah, we kind of need to draw our cards. I think he was hoping we were going to play one more. I think he's going to get... Like a Gezerus or a Gaten right here. Mm-hmm. Because he is Devotion, and he spent Forest already. Yeah. So now he's the only other one he has is uh, Isengrim Council. Yeah, I think we got a good card out of him. So he spent all his tutors. Mm. Yeah, he spent a call as well as Council. Like I think this went really well for us, given the garbage state of our hand. Yeah. That was nice. Uh, he also spent the leader charge, I think, right? Yep. So that's pretty big too. Um, because, yeah, he needs to move the defender, actually. Hey! Really 
the other way. That's our dry pass card. Maybe we just mold the Ozril here. Try to look for like Siri or. There we go. Okay. Well, there's your golds. Yep. <laughs> Turns out they will. That was a good maxi, man. That was a really good maxi. Because this Onira was at the bottom. Ooh. The... Oh. So we now go far. Or do we. Sure. Yeah, can just go with this. Do we go oh, back front. row? Front row, front row, front Ah, because of Gezra, right? Yeah. Sure. Could go back. Corpses overboard. Light ones to the cage. I was just thinking maybe we want to, like, cave troll. Ah, it's fine. I yeah. was thinking we cave troll back row. Instead of Wait, he it's can't deal with he can't deal with it now, right? Uh, well, not really. Yeah, we just go front throw defender and then. I guess he can have his own movement. Yeah, 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 exactly. What if we Ex went Siri, or is that too nah, slow? It's no time, no time. It's too late. But yeah, we just go with this now. See what he can do. I don't know about this bleed, seems really bad to me. Ah, there's two of those, of course. Humans are scum. I guess it's now. Kelly time. And we get a oh I don't I guess we only get a two out of him, that kinda hurts. Well it's not bad because our one also dies and then his four dies. Uh, so you use a leader charge, right? On... Doesn't really matter. Just not on the one, basically. Yeah, that's... Yeah. Would be nice if we, like... Oh, okay. Well, that's all she wrote. Does he really think he's in a good spot here, or what? Like, I don't understand. Yeah, I mean, he spent his defender. Holy cow, like, he played this game terribly. <laughs> I don't know. Thank well, God! <laughs> yeah, like, this, this matchup is really bad with the Bruver. You have to have cards, though, sir. Um, yeah, kind of true. Because we have to play I this first. D-bomb could be okay. I don't know about Pact, it's a bit weird. Uh, drop one of these, I suppose. Oof. You could also just go Siri, but I don't know how good is that. The Osral is a 10. Uh, yeah, this hand doesn't really... We missed... Like, we just drew bronzes, right? Five bronzes? Kinda hilarious. Yeah. I should have um, leader charged in it. Yeah, you should have definitely leadered it. Yeah. Not sure why. Oh! <laughs> so we have to go Siri now. Wait, why? Oh, no, we go. We just go Osril later. Oh, yeah, that, just was... Go. that was so dumb. What do I do now? Just Osril. Eat the Kelly and. Win the oh, game. That was so stupid of me. It's okay, it's okay. It's not that big of a deal, honestly. Like, it, it will not cost you the game, basically, if that's what you're worried about. Do I leader but, charge? Yeah. Nah, you can't kill this. Famous. There's nothing in the Scoyotel that deals 8 damage. So, yeah, we just kill those. And <laughs> he, he's not gonna have any units of his own, you know what I mean? Like, that's yeah. the issue. Oh but my yeah. god. Fun little game of Kelly, I suppose. The, the, like, the Bruver matchup is really tough. Uh, have you passed? I don't think you passed. Oh, no. Oh, you did? No, I didn't. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. I snapped it so quick. I was like, oh. <laughs> don't make him suffer any longer. Ah. Uh, so that's yeah, five. Yeah. So we just leader, leader, and heat wave, huh? Or do we save it for? Um, I think you heat wave, yeah. 
What if it, his last card's... Well, Let's look at his deck. Would it be Gord? No. It, it wouldn't matter anyways. It's really small if it's Gord, yeah. Can just uh, heatwave this, use the leader, it doesn't really matter. Yeah, this is the biggest unit he has for sure. I think he might have like a dead brand in hand or something like that. <laughs> yeah. Get caught. <laughs> well, oh, it took a minute cool. here, but we got there. I mean, yeah, yeah. He like the round one, given given our, how bad our hand was, like we I got off know, so he, easy, and he spent so much. Yeah, call and like council, it was just crazy. Over a leader there. charge. Yeah, like location. The beast, the beast, the beast uh, solo carried the game there, right? Yeah. It's just, Some it's Kelly just, gameplay. Uh, Wasubi, thanks for hanging out, sir. We appreciate you. Very um, good deck, guys. Oh yeah, if you can uh, actually draw gold cards, it's fantastic. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Um, Very true. By the time this comes out, it, uh, it'll almost be season over. Do you think there'll be any balance changes or anything? Or I, 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 to Kelly, I don't think so. The but mentor overall, they got to put back at three, right? Or maybe or four. I mean, what was it? Three or four? It was three, right? Uh, the the clogger mentor. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. It was adrenaline two. Yeah, now it's the it is three. Two adrenaline three. Yeah. So it goes. It, it should go back to two. Yeah, probably. But I, I actually, I wouldn't expect like a significant balance patch or anything. Uh, maybe just a couple of minor changes. But yeah, Kelly is definitely the deck to play. For sure. Hey, but that's the video for today, guys. Make sure you check out uh, TLG.GG for the meta snapshot, uh, some other stuff. And the um, the TV's coming real soon, so keep an eye out for that. And if you're interested yep. in coaching from, I like, guess Gravish doing it. Oh yeah, I mean, oh man, like, yeah. I might even spring for a Gravish coaching session <laughs> just for uh, the entertainment value. <laughs> why not? Why not? But uh, Asubi, like, uh, like always, thank you so much, man. We appreciate you, and you guys, thank you so much for watching me play Gwent on my couch. <laughs> we'll see. Yeah, I'm happy to be here, man. It's it's always fun. Yeah, we we enjoy you, Rusubi. We enjoy having you hang out, man. Um, that's the video, though, guys. We'll see you next time.